When you're ready, meet me at the Pnyx in Athens. Come on. together now for the glory of Athens! Glory for you! <laughs> Friend, friends, please! Just because the Spartans are near our walls does not mean we can act like them! A good crop! Shame the Spartans burned the fields where it grew! The Parthenon is glorious, Pericles, but at what cost? How many tree dams could we have built instead? We must not become divided! We are divided! And the Spartans are winning! Act, Pericles, or I will! Oh, good. You came. Things are worse than I feared. Cleon has turned the mob. We have to hurry. Where? To Pericles. Stay back! She is no threat to Pericles. I assure you. Ah, Herodotus. It's fine. Let them through. It's good to see you again, Pericles. And you as well. I only wish it were under better circumstances. And who's this? Cassandra. Welcome, Cassandra. And what did you think of your first taste of Athens? I think you did a great job. It's so easy to forget the good someone has done when times become hard. Pericles, we've come to... We must choose our moment wisely and speak our words more privately. Fine. We've come to you on urgent business. As does everybody. I may have told Cassandra you'd invite her to your symposium. You'd ask me to exclude every Athenian and invite an outsider instead. You heard the crowd. They don't need another reason to hate me. If she's working for you, maybe the prying eyes will see her as a servant. I'm no one's servant. Cassandra. This is Athens. If you want something, sometimes you have to play a role. And what exactly is it that you want? I'm looking for a woman who's very important to me. Herodotus said a symposium could be useful for gaining information. He would be correct. I can get you in, although I can't promise the information you seek will be found. Just tell me what to do. First, check on my colleague, Mediochos. He was meant to meet me today, and it's not like him to miss an appointment. Done. My friend, Phidias, needs to be taken out of Athens as soon as possible. Anything else? Yes. There's an ostracism vote taking place that could use your... Uh, influence. I'll do it. I'll expect you to use discretion. That went well. It isn't exactly an invitation, but the promise of one is just as good. Although I'm sure he'll still ask Aspasia if it's okay. So long as it comes. 
Blessed be the god that sent you here. I'd have been eaten alive if it weren't for you. I don't think they'd eat you. But they would have certainly killed me. So thank you. I'm always happy to help someone in need. The world could do with more like you. Especially now. Pericles sent me. He was worried about you. You often get tied up and surrounded by snakes. How can you joke about this? Fox broke into my home, dragged me here, tied me up and surrounded me with these hideous creatures. They must be stopped. The snakes? The thugs! I'll track them down, Metilhos. Don't worry. Tensions are high right now. At this rate, we'll tear each other apart within the city before the Spartans can breach the walls. Part of Athens, I doubt Pericles is proud to talk about. It looks like the thugs who attacked Metiochos weren't the masterminds behind this plot. Snake bites, and someone hid the body. Though I have a feeling this death was an accident. <laughs> Snakes. Like the ones that were meant to kill Metiochos. This must be the house of Metiochos' attackers. But the letter proves they're just tools in someone else's plan. Whose? What the fuck are you doing sniffing around my house? You attacked Metiochos. I found the snakes, the letter from your friend, and a body. All here. Ah, oh, poor Actis. We all knew the risks. Chains don't happen without a bit of blood being spilled. I know someone gave you those snakes. They used you to do their dirty work. I want to know who. He's a real hero of Athens. No puppet of Pericles is going to stop him. Tell me what I want to know, or I'll cut you down right now. Your cause will be forgotten, and so will you. All right, all right. He's got a camp just outside the walls. Sells his snakes from there. You've crossed a line. Now you must pay the price. We will never surrender to the likes of you. We will make Athens great again. <laughs> <laughs> I need to rid Athens of this snake seller.
you'll feel the sting of my venom. Εγκατελείφθης παραλοφίσκο. Can I help you with something? There's another merchant who's begun selling to many of the same towns I do, undercutting me with inferior product. His wines are like oil. His olive oil is like tar. If your wares are better, you shouldn't worry about competition. He needs a message delivered to him. Him and his pitiful wares, delivered by one like you. Maybe he'll back off before I have to take more drastic measures, huh? So you want me to bring this to the merchant? No. Killing him is the only way. You're on your own. The gods have forsaken. <laughs> Looks like your situation's improved since we last met. The danger has passed for now. But while those monsters are out there, no one is safe. A group of fishermen tied you up. They were being used by a snake dealer working for enemies of Athens. What did you do with them? I gave them what the gods demanded. Justice. The punishment seems fair. Still, it pains me to see sons and daughters of Athens turning against one another. They tried to kill you. If I hadn't arrived when I did, they would have succeeded. Thank you for your help, Mystios. I'll be sure to mention it to Pericles. <laughs> 